Hi, I'm Lewis Cahill from Ginga Gasoline. I'm at Bears Lodge on South Andres, Bahamas, here at the January Bonefish School. And I want to take a minute to talk to you about what I think is the most important thing in saltwater fly fishing, and that's the ready position. A good ready position allows you to react, react quickly when fish show up, and it also lets every shot come off perfectly clean. There's a lot of different opinions on how to do this. For what it's worth, I'm going to show you mine, and it works for me very well. And I think if you give it a try, you'll like it too. So when you get up on the bow, the first thing you're going to do is strip off the fly line that you think you can cast. That's what you're going to be working with. And then you're going to pull out your leash. And your leash consists of nine feet of your fly line outside of the tip top. So every time I step up on the bow, I do this. I just pull my fly line back and I check to see that my fly line comes to the end of my rod. I know I have nine feet. Then I have my 12 foot leader. So nine feet of fly line plus my 12 foot leader. Then what I'm going to do is take my running line that comes out of the stripper guide on my rod and I'm going to hold that against the grip with my index finger and my middle finger of my rod hand. Then I take my fly and I pinch it by the, end, by the bend of the hook between my index finger and my thumb of my right hand. I hold my running line in my left hand and I'm ready to cast. Now when my guide calls out a fish, I can point, find the fish, and when I'm ready to cast, my first casting motion is into my back cast away from the fish. Now you'll notice that when I do that, my rod immediately starts to load and the line aerializes. When that line starts to aerialize, I let go of my fly and make my shot. And that comes off clean every time. There's no chance that the fly is going to catch in the gunnel of the boat or in my shirt that's flapping in the breeze or in my finger or anything else. It's just going to go out straight in front of the fish. The other real benefit to that is that if you do a lot of bone fishing, you know you get a lot of 30 foot shots, especially on days when the sun's not out and it's hard to see. With nine feet of rod, nine feet of fly line, and 12 feet of leader, I can make a 30 foot shot without any false casting and I can hit that fish in a hurry, which is important when fish are close. Try that next time you're out flats fishing and see if it doesn't help you take advantage of your opportunities. Thanks for tuning in and stay with us at Ginkin Gasoline for more fly fishing tips, tricks, and how to.